the structures that we're working with uh, that goes into devices like this uh, has, not, has never been made before. Uh, solar cells that you can buy uh, at the moment, you have to put on a roof, they're quite heavy. With this, we're able to um, use it in a more flexible fashion. Here in my hand is just a piece of plastic uh, with a uh, chemical compound, a fluorescent dye incorporated inside. The overall uh, device here has a uh, glow. You can see the a yellow greenish glow, but it's uh, a lot brighter on the edge. The emission from the dye is trapped inside a plastic through a process called total internal reflection. Because it is plastic, it can be molded into different shapes. Rod shapes, you can have columns, um, spherical is also possible. You can use it uh, purely for aesthetics or you can actually then uh, use a solar cell to capture the light to generate the electricity. A fluorescent chandelier would be uh, one, one, an option where it's purely for aesthetics. We've taken a piece of this plastic and then stuck some flexible solar cells, flexible solar panels to the edge. But if your plastic is thick enough, then you can mount the solar cell on the edge. Incorporate yellow or red or blue. You have the freedom to choose uh, whatever color, anything you like. Not just architecture, but objects. The possibilities are infinite.